What's up, y'all? I had this on my heart to talk about because for some reason, it was on my mind over and over again. So it was meant for me to talk about it. <clears throat> A lot of people wondering, how is she so happy and positive in her situation without money, without exotic cars? And I'm going to tell you the truth. I tell you right now, I'm humble. I'm very humble. A lot of people say they humble until they go broke. I'm humble. Okay? Hold on, y'all. Because I want you to hear me good. I'm humble. 48 Laws of Power talks about despising a free lunch. Because let me tell you why. That just really popped in my mind the way it did. When you always looking for a handout, you opening that energy to be codependent. Like you can't move forward without another person. A lot of, let me tell you something. For me to shout, I'm a queen, that holds a lot of power. A lot of people want that kind of power. But they don't understand the responsibility that come with it. Okay? Are you willing to go without a drink? Are you willing to go without that blunt? Are you willing to buy your own bottle instead of somebody else pouring you a drink? This is no different from going to the club and somebody offer you a drink and you didn't watch them pour it. You got to understand that it's going to be plenty of people wanting your power. It's going to be plenty of people that want to snatch your spot, humiliate you, make you look foolish, make you look crazy. Is that something you ready for? Because it's so easy to say, oh, that person doesn't deserve it. I have another drink. You're not ready. You asking to swim with sharks, but you still a fish. And I'm not targeting nobody because you know how they go. People take what I say so personal because they got a personal problem with me. And that's, that don't have nothing to do with me because, you know, hey, that's their problem. I'm giving you the real. What goes on when you broke is the same thing that go on when you got money. Nothing changes. You take a trip. You get on a boat. Somebody invites you out. You want to fit in so bad. So you take that drink. You don't even know who fixed it, but you got it. You got to be sound-minded. The laws of wisdom talks about that. First of all, if you go somewhere for the first time, you shouldn't be doing anything. You, you got to be aware of your surroundings at all times. You got to peep the scene. You got to feel the energy. If that person is not willing to be with you alone, then don't be with them in a crowd. You outnumbered. Something like that. That's how folks get fucked off. Fuck around the whole internet. Got a whole photo of you with your ass out. Fuck around. Folks got a whole photo of you all around the internet. Because let me tell you something. Once it's on the internet, it's on it forever. Face glistening. Everybody children on your face. That's a little hardcore. And I know folks be like, damn, why she said like that? I'm just, I mean, what you want to hear? They children? They unborn children? Or come? Semen. Which one you want here? Any other way, you humiliated. And you gotta you gotta keep your integrity at all times. But why do you have to be humiliated in order to get that to even form integrity? You should have already had it from the jump. I'm not knocking nobody who been because guess what? I've been humiliated several times. But this is for folks who, who talk about they want to step into something but don't know what come with it. You just want the title. You want the label. You want to be known for something. Let me tell you something.
You got to remain who you are at all times because you're going to have haters with lint in your pocket. You're going to have haters with millions in your bank account. They don't go away. You could be just a peaceful person. And they hate that because they can't understand it. Nobody helped them unlock that. So I'm telling you, you got to be mindful. Keep a sound mind. New lovers have new devils. You can't be ready to sleep with everybody because they look good. They got a fat ass. They got some money. They got a big penis. Your body is sacred. You know, people lose themselves along the way. They felt like they sold themselves out. Man, there's always going to be more opportunities out there for you. The key is how you going to respect yourself or how you going to conduct yourself in the process. You got to understand when you come around these people, you go around these people, you got to know their intentions. You can't just want to go and party. You can party broke. You can party in your car. Everything you can do broke, you can do with money. You can do without money. You can do it, you know, with powerless people. You can do it with powerful people. Are you ready for that? Is that something you want? I'm being real now. Because it's so easy to hate, but you don't understand what it takes to know what you're stepping into because you're stepping into the unknown. You're putting your feet in some water that you don't know if there's some piranhas in there. You don't know if there's some sharks in there. You don't know. You're just getting your foot wet because you went in there with an unsounded mind. You want to hate on the next person. You got something to say, but you don't, you don't have what it takes. I want you to be wise. Be wise. I can't stress that enough. Be wise. Especially for my ladies. It's not going to be a lot of men that's going to accept your power simply because you a woman doing this. Some men don't like that. There's a lot of men out there that feels that women should always be beneath them. So they're going to find ways to put you there. Are you ready for that? Are you ready to stand your ground? Are you comfortable with saying no? Are you comfortable with not laughing when it's not funny? Are you comfortable with that? Because that's going to come. You, you got to understand you're not going to please everybody. You ain't going to make everybody happy. So understand. It. Be wise. Despise a free lunch at times. Matter of fact, all the time. That falls under the 48 laws of power. If you give me this stack of money, do I got to give you some coochie? Because I don't want to. Be smart. That person ain't willing to talk about marriage or being long term with you. Because let me tell you something. Even a man who want to be with you or want to be more powerful than you in some form of fashion. Understand this. He got to know. Oh, she want marriage. She want long term. A man like that ain't going to embarrass himself. And if you marry to him, he ain't going to let you embarrass yourself because it's going to embarrass him. Be wise. Be wise. Are you ready for that? Don't be no fool. Don't be egotistical. Be wise. Man, I want to hear what I got to say. And I appreciate all the love from the ones that do. And there's some powerful people that watch me. And they like, she know what the fuck she talking about. They better listen to her. 
This shit is not a game. You talking about sitting around big people. And every smile ain't a smile. Some think about it. You think if you see a dog teeth, they smiling at you all the time. Some of them are hungry. And you look like fresh meat. You ready for that? Be wise. Don't go in there telling everything you know. Watch the room. Everybody ain't your friend. Watch the room. Get to know them. Watch the room. Mind is a powerful thing. Knowledge is so much has so much power. Because when you know better, you do better. Y'all be blessed.